Dozens of Perth families could be kicked out of their homes to make way for a new freight link. Residents in Palmyra near Fremantle say they're stressed and in limbo. Young families, elderly residents and people who've lived in the same home for decades all told their properties could be demolished to make way for a $1.6 billion freight line. Among them, 88-year-old Kevin Gleeson. At the moment I feel shot. I'm really upset and this is really gnawing at me because I've been left in a state of uncertainty. He's lived in this Palmyra home for 20 years. His wife passed away five years ago and Kevin relies on neighbours for support. I keep the place clean and tidy. I have good neighbours around, around me who keep an eye on me. Today, dozens of residents held a protest in Moody Glen, Palmyra, one of the streets affected. At least 77 properties in up to 20 streets are at risk of being bought back and bulldozed to make way for the Perth Freight Link, which would link Fremantle Port to the industrial areas of Kewdale, Welshpool and Canningvale, reducing pressure on existing roads. These residents have been told a final decision will be made in November. Construction is due to start on the project next year. Laura and Chris Omade have two kids under four years old and say it's incredibly stressful being in limbo. And now we've got to find a similar house in, in the same kind of area, but is that going to be possible for us? And even, even with that, we don't want to move. We're, we're happy where we're at. We are at the moment. We will make sure that anyone who is affected is treated fairly, but unfortunately that does happen in major projects. Um, there will be some houses or some private commercial property that will be in the way. They can't compensate us for something that we've poured our whole heart and soul into. Lee Steele, Nine News.